What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we have another battle box. Uh, this is my second one that I've opened. Um, you know, the first one I was a little underwhelmed by. Uh, I was kind of expecting, I guess, a little more for it. So hopefully this one can make up for it and uh, turn my opinion around on the battle box. Let's open it. Okay, battle box number two. Here we go. Battle box. Survival and tactical gear delivered monthly. All right. Like I said before, my first experience in the battle box wasn't very good, so um, I kind of hope this one's a little better. Hope, hope, hope this is better. So let's see what we got in this. Thing. All right. First things first, I see my card here. This is Mission 14 Blackout from April 2016. On the back, it kind of gives you a little, little story. Um, you know, it says the threat is real. An EMP has the potential to severely decimate the electronic world as we know it. America itself could be sent back to the 19th century. So that's really cool. It gives you some tips for EMP attack, that type of thing. So basically what that's saying is the theme of this box is EMP, EMP related. So the first thing I see here kind of sticking out at me, we have a, kind of wore off there, but a liquid paraffin emergency candle, 115 hour emergency candle, uh, odorless, smokeless, it's kind of neat. Looks like BattleBox's own, own kind of thing here. Let's see if I can get the lid off. I'm sure, there's probably instructions to this, but um, let's see what we can figure out here. Basically, emergency candle. We'll go ahead and get that lid here in a little bit. Let's see what else we got? Emergency candle. 115 hours. Not bad. Not bad. Next thing we have in here is. Luminade, pack light 16. Well, I see some sort of a solar panel there. It's got our battle box logo on the back. Something else branded for battle box. It's pretty cool. Looks like it's a light. It's got different uh, levels of illumination here. It's kind of neat. Look at my cheat sheet here and see what this is. Um, this is Illuminate Packlight 16 Solar Light. So there you go, this is all it does. Um, lights of varying degrees of brightness and it's charged by the sun. You can see here it's got a little indicator. Green is charged, red is charging. So I imagine if you put this out in the sun, this should turn red and charge you a little light. That's kind of neat, you know. Let's see what's in here. Here's our instructions for it. Charge outside in direct sunlight for seven to 10 hours. Uh, red indicates the solar panel is exposed. It will turn green when it's 95% charged. Um, oh, it's inflatable. This will actually float. That's what this is. This is a bag. You can see here, you basically blow this up like any random pool toy that you have and you got a floating light. So that's actually pretty neat. This would be good to have for like a boat. You know, keep this in your boat if you have one. Not bad, not bad. Moving on, let's see what else we got in this box. Okay, dig around in here. We got something. Fold top Faraday, fold top of Faraday bag over twice. Okay, so this would be our um, nylon EMP Faraday bag. Let's open it up. Here's our Faraday bag. I can feel there's some type of metal kind of grid type material inside of here. Uh, for those of you who don't know what a Faraday bag is, it's supposed to, you know, you're putting electronics in here, your cell phone, um, you know, key fobs, that type of thing in here. And then you can um, basically, it, it keeps, it keeps the EMP pulses from reaching your electronics. Uh, basically this metal around it in the bag here um, kind of, absorbs and grounds out the pulse and it doesn't get to your electronics inside. So that's kind of neat. So you fold this over twice, once like that, and boom, once like that, then anything you have in this bag will be protected from an EMP pulse. Good to have. Let's see if there's anything else. Oh, I feel something in here. What is this? A book. 
Living off the grid, a simple guide to creating and maintaining a self-reliant supply of energy, water, shelter, and more. Hmm, that's interesting. Good little survival book here. Living off the grid book. Solar power, photovoltaic cells, getting wind power, basically everything you need in here. Hybrid dwellings, earth bags, logs, straw, adobe homes. Wow, pretty comprehensive. That'd be good, good reads. Good uh, toilet reads, if you know what I mean. I don't know if people still do that. Now we all have cell phones, so we just kind of use that as our toilet reading. Okay, uh, next we have some bags. These are our Mylar EMP bags. Same type of thing, except these are made out of Mylar. They don't have that uh, Faraday you know, inside of them. This basically is good for uh, electrostatic discharge. That's what these bags are good for. I don't really think they're going to do much for EMP pulse, but you know, if you have something that's uh, static sensitive, like uh, computer parts or radio parts or anything like that, if you store them in these bags, it'll it'll help protect them against you know static electricity uh, you know if you touch them you get that little spark you don't want that to happen if you're in these bags uh, you're safe so that's cool um, i think that's it these are some more bags here the emp bags can't have too many of those i suppose and is that all we got all right let's check our check our card here make sure we got everything we had our luminite pack light we had our emergency candle we had our book our Faraday bag and our three uh, Mylar EMP bags. Actually, it's a small, medium, and large times two, so it's actually six bags total. You can see there, it kind of gives you a pricing breakdown for everything, so you can decide if this is a good value or not. Uh, obviously, the box is valued at $150. Um, you know, I paid $24.99 plus, I think it was five or six shipping, so 30 bucks total in it, 150 value, that's what they claim. I'm sure they didn't pay that for this, but uh, you know, form your own opinion. And then if I set up to the advanced subscription, that's uh, $49, it's got 198 value. Basically you get all of this and then it would include a hybrid light, solar flashlight and a bail thing. I think that's what that is. I'm not sure. Um, Walkie talkie slash ham radio. That's kind of neat. Uh, the pro is $99 and they throw in all of that plus a four way uh, uh, weather radio and uh, another solar light and a charger which is cool the solar chargers are really neat charge your cell phone up with uh, you know sunlight so that would be cool to have and the pro plus uh they throw in uh clicker cordan light it's 150 dollar value so there you go that was on tap for april mission 14 blackout all right so there you have it mission 14 what'd you think that was a little better than my first box uh, we didn't see my first battle box uh, go ahead and click right here uh, you can check that out let me know what you think um, some of the highlights from the box i really like this uh faraday bag this is pretty neat keep our electronics safe and uh this floatable um alumi illuminate light as they call it which is pretty neat solar solar powered light um, that's the two highlights for me really um everything else the book honestly who reads the books with the internet these days Everything you can find in that book, you can find on the internet for probably easier and faster. Other than that, everything else is pretty pretty cheap. I mean, these EMP bags, meh. Nah. Candle, meh. Nah. So overall, better than the first one. Still not great. There's definitely room to improve. Um, but if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. That way you'll be alerted to all my future videos in your feed. Um, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you want to see next. Um, if there's any other subscription boxes out there you'd like me to see, uh, let me know. Um, I do uh, the Battle Box, Alpha Outpost, Tac Pack. That's really the big three. So if there's any other that you want to see, let me know. I'm, I'm totally for checking them out. If they look cool, I'll unbox them right here on this channel. So thanks for watching. And until next time, I'm Adam. See ya.